Welcome back to City Skylines in the city of Atlantis. And today we are working in this little area here that was left from our previous episode. So that's what I'm talking about. We want to work on this area and grow this new little city or a small suburb that we're connecting to our main city over there. And this area is actually becoming one of my favorites in the game so far. Not in the game, but in this Let's Play series. And there's a lot of reasons for that. I think the layout of the city and having the uh, metro going through above ground in here. We have the train. We do have this nice park in the middle here, which is already level 3, mind you. We are almost level 4 there. And this highway connection here, which is kind of unique from what we usually see. It's really different. And I think this area came alive very quickly. And the idea here is that we extend this um, tourism district into this area here, over there. And then we start working on our residential area, expanding it all the way over here along the this smaller river in there and that'll be the plan for today i also want to make this a shorter episode because i want to get ready for the next one uh which will be extending this metro line which will probably involve changing a few things on the public transport but uh we'll get there when we get there but for now i will work on this area and then i do just a speed speed build in this case just so you understand what I'm thinking what I'm doing and I just want this to get to boring so depending on how long it gets I'll just cut a few parts but we will get there and we have an auto save going on at the moment but yeah I hope you enjoy the journey and I'll see you in the other side Yeah. 
I do feel at this moment that I'm missing something big in here and I can't put a pin on it. I'm just like looking at the map, going back and forth and thinking, what am I missing in here? We have a basic service. Uh, I didn't add schools because we have one that's closed, which is this one. And this area will be all residential. I do have a fire station, police station, this one, I don't remember what is that, I think it's the medical clinic. We have the elder care, we have the child care in there, and we have a few parks around. I've changed one thing, this block in here will be an IT cluster, so this will look like the town center or downtown, uh, depends on where you are and how you call it. I thought about putting a pedestrian cross in here, but I'm not doing that yet. I want to see how this behaves because we do have public transport that helps them crossing. So if they use that, I, I would prefer. But yeah, I, I feel like I am missing something. I do have like uh, water, that's all there. I do have zoning. Um, so talking about zoning, I have let, left this as a low density around this road here, the one facing the river, everything else is high density. We have offices here for the IT park, we have some offices there near the, uh, the train station. This works as a buffer for the, the, the line. And in here I put a cemetery because we have the plaza of the dead so i thought well you know what that's a great place for a cemetery in there i'll add some trees in here to create a buffer as well uh, we've added the pathways so they have access everywhere we might add just one in there let me quickly do it just to make it easier for everyone one thing that we could do actually is remove all these trees because they will be demolished anyway as soon as we start building these trees will just go away so don't need to have that we will do some uh, detailing and adding more trees later on so i think it's fair to say that we don't need any of those yeah that's good but yeah i don't know if i'm missing something in here or not but we'll take a look at that I'm also leaving some space near this main uh, avenue here. As this will be the main conductor in this area, I want to leave, leave this area as clean as or as free as possible, I should say. And but let's see how that goes. Uh, if we remember what we are missing there, then we will know. We'll figure it out. And maybe let's get this view and let's press play and see how that goes. And there we go, as you can see the area is growing quite a lot and we still have space to grow even more. We have the lower density residential and commercial there to grow a little bit further. We do have some uh, high density commercial, uh, sorry, residential in here to, to grow and this is coming along. Yeah, it's quite nice. This is an area that I would leave for sure. And yeah, it just feels good in here, doesn't it? Uh, there are a few more places where we can do detailing. There are a few more places that still need to grow. But I just like how this area is turning to be. And if you look at it from here, there we go. That's exactly what I wanted there. Those tall buildings in the IT cluster. So you have some sort of center area for this, this city. And as you can see, this is the tallest buildings in the area. And this will probably change slightly as we go. As you can see, there are more buildings uh, growing in here, but I don't expect this to change too much because the area is quite small as well. So yeah, that is that. 
Uh, but this is looking quite good. One thing that I want to take a look there is actually public transportation. I want to see how many people we are using on our metro and 127, that's a lot more than we had before. And we have 137 just waiting in here. Oh yes, that's so good. Like we are getting a full train, which tells me that we need a second train. Yay, or subway or metro or however you want to call it. Yeah, that's getting busy. I love that. And that's exactly what I want to see here. And that will set the pace for what we do next, which is uh, extending our metro line even further. But I think for now, this is exactly what we wanted. We do have some demand here for industrial, which I can actually add in here, most likely. I don't want to use any industrial on the main road there. I think they need to be at the back. It will work better if they do so. And yeah, but this area is working quite well. I love to see how many people we have waiting there. Definitely we need more uh, people coming to shop in here. As you can see, we have not enough customers, but we will fix that when we also fix the public transportation. Obviously, we don't have any buses coming here. So the idea, uh, I think, would be splitting these into instead of one big line, I'll have multiple lines going there and coming back to the main station. And then the metro will go all the way to the main city in here. Uh, we have someone sitting there. But yeah, this roundabout here is actually better. So it seems like adding those connections there and the buses are working for us as well. I also want to bring some more jobs into this area. And the way I want to do this is by filling some of these gaps. I think that would be quite good for us and having more farms in here, I think will help fill this area. And yeah, how are we doing with our university? Still not enough uh, students, which is fine. I think this is one of the things that we will work on later. And but now that we have a lot more people, I don't remember how many people we had in the city, but at least like we grow this about 2000 more and we have a bit of fire and it's gone. All right. Working pretty well, working pretty well. This is getting as always, it's getting like a little bit busy, uh, but as I think we need to fix our public transportation in order to get that going quite nicely. And there we go. We just reached capital city, 24,000 people, and we've unlocked the ship service, which is nice because I saw that we have a ship line very close and now we can have a harbor, cargo harbor. Oh yes, eco water treatment plant and the American Football Stadium and the uh, Advanced Inland Water Treatment Plant, which is fantastic because we need to have better capacity of treating our water. At the moment, it has been a struggle. But yeah, the, if we look at the uh, ship line, it goes through here and goes up there. So that'll be a nice place for something like that as well. And it seems like we need more water and I can get then a water tower somewhere in here. And there we go, water for everyone. Yeah, it seems like a good place for that. I can do some detailing in here to make this look a little bit nicer. But yeah, I like that. Oh, okay. this area is just looking good. Okay, how did you like it? Uh, did you find this area nice? Uh, do you want me to add something else in here? Obviously, I'll do the detailing uh, and you'll see how that will look after I finish that. But for the moment, I, I'm happy with how this is looking. We've managed to grow this, we've created more demand for the public transport in here, and now we can work on our expansion. And 
yeah if you have any ideas on how to make it even better just let me know in the comments or join my discord server so we can have a chat and i can ask you questions uh, i can answer your questions or try to at least and i can help you with some things and you can give me your suggestions as well and also don't forget to leave a like on this video that helps me a lot don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already so you can see what we do with the public transportation in the next episode and how this area looks when i finish detailing it and i'll see you in the next one bye bye